Tony Dan here again. Um, I uh, have a situation where I'm going to, uh, I need to do something I thought I'd make a good tutorial. Um, I'm sure you've come across where you've gotten separations from somebody on the outside, but now you need to make a, uh, an art proof of that with the background removed and you want to put it on a shirt. So here's one simple way. You've got Photoshop separations, they're grayscale seps, but you can't do anything with those in terms of like an RGB or a CMYK file to put on a t-shirt. Yes, you can. So here we go. You're going to move these, create new channels, move them up in front of the separations. Simply go to the image mode and change to RGB. That converts these first three layers into an RGB file. And uh, let's say, I don't know, uh, navy background. So we're going to do a, go with a little bit of a navy color there on the background. And then um, take the base white, hold down the command or control key, click on that channel, fill it onto the new layer with white in the foreground. Uh, let me grab this. So, be a little less confusing. So, uh, I'm going to paint with white on a new layer. Yeah. Option delete, that's my base white. Yellow, same thing. Command or control click on the layer. It could be the layer name out here. Some people get confused and they, they, they want to turn on the eyeballs. That's not what I'm talking about. Just click on the channel name, activate the RGB layers, go to a new layer, pop in the color. You could even reference Pantones. That's the yellow. Do the red or whatever color you might have. Pop it up and talk. 185. Or is it 1805? eighteen oh five it's a little more rusty rusty red and then a Pantone process blue which is not cyan uh, there we go that is not a cyan that's a separate Pantone color a lot of people get that confused too um, can pop down there to get the black, pop back up, and type in D for default colors with black in the foreground, option delete. I fill that on a separate layer. So these are just like my separations in layers. Now that's my merged file, but guess what? I just delete the background, merge those together, Crop out the, delete out the top registration marks, color names, and stuff. And, um, and then uh, you can go to File, Save as a Copy, drag down to PNG. For Comp. I'll uh, put it in my folder for my art proof and uh, that's that. That's going to leave it with a transparent background. Done.